hey guys welcome back to the course in this lecture I will teach you how you can increase CTR CPC and RPM inside the Google Adsense account so before that first of all you have to understand uh, what are these things basically first of all let me save this file about uh, increasing uh, increasing Adsense revenue okay now before increasing CTR, CPC and RPM first of all you need to know what these are what are CTR, CPC and RPM ok the first one is CTR stands for click through rate ok the second one is CPC stands for cost cost per click the third one is RPM stands for revenue per mile ok now once again the CTR is basically the uh, click through rate for example 100 people visited to your site 10 people click the ads okay so CTR is the percentage of people who visit your site and how many people click the ads the Google ads so if 100 people have visited your website and 10 out of those 100 people have clicked the ads because every person is not uh, cannot click the ads some people click the ads so there become a percentage of people who uh, click the ads so everyone will not uh, actually click the ads so out of 100 people if 10 people click the ads that means the CTR is 10 percent very simple out of 100 people 10 people click the ads so uh, there will be 10 percent the CTR will be 10 percent now next is CPC rate so CPC rate for, uh, is for clicks I mean cost per click so if uh, 10 people click the the age and you earn 10 dollars I mean those 10 people who click the ads you earn ten dollars from that that's mean the CTR will be one dollar I mean click through uh, cost per sorry CTR not CPC cost per click will be one dollar and if you made one dollar from these ten people then this will be dot zero one one cent this is the simple formula for CTR now the next thing is the RPM thousand visitors impression also called impression you made uh, a hundred dollars ten dollars so your RPM will be RPM will be equal to US ten dollars let's take I mean revenue per thousand impressions how much revenue you have made from thousand impressions this is something like that so I hope you have understood this simple thing this is about the click through rate I mean total people and out of those total people how many click the ad becomes the percentage of CTR and this is the cost per click one click has earned you how much that becomes the CPC and from thousand impressions how much money have you earned in total becomes the RPM very simple thing 
uh, and I will sh uh, first show you the real example of this and then I will tell you how you can increase it so here is the real example from the previous lecture we were in on this page so from the United States there are 2731 pages you know and 31 clicks only from around 3000 page views there are only 31 clicks so the CTR becomes only 1% because out of 100 per 100 page views there is only one click so automatically CTR is very low and the CPC is 1.23 above one dollar that's mean cost per click one click is equal to this money and the RPM page RPM is thirteen dollars and something uh, like uh, almost fourteen dollar that's mean from thousand impressions how much we earn so you see two thousand seven hundred page views and thirteen dollars per thousand impressions and total earning is here same you can see for other countries like you see for Saudi Arabia two hundred twenty seven page views seven clicks and the CTR is higher here uh, three percent because from hundred people three clicked so three about three percentage here for CTR but the CPC is low 15 cent per click and from thousand impression there is only four seventy five earning four seventy five dollar earning that's it because there is no thousand impressions only two hundred twenty seven impressions therefore the earning is one dollar but if there were f uh, thousand impressions the earning would be this one four above four dollars so that is the simplest thing for you to understand about CTR CPC and things like that now how you can actually increase CTR for CTR you will have to actually work or the placements if you have if you don't have any aid here on this list must add an aid here if you don't have an ad just on the single pages just above the below the this title or you may be having another website about products or about any other things so just keep your ad units exactly uh, aligned with the content you know so people will be actually uh, clicking the ads in the CTR will increase this one in this one and also you can uh, this area as I told you so people will be clicking my overall CTR is about 3% so if you are as 3% then that's okay uh, that's you are going very well but if less than 3 or less than 2 then you are going uh, you know very low so you should to work on your CTR so about 3 CTR is perfect uh, so you have to work on the placements of your uh, site and your ads because this is related to placements the click through rate if you are not using the ads on right places then this will not increase and people will not click on theirs now the next part is CPC cost per click this is related to keywords and I mean the topic of the website and also the geographical location of the visitors if you have visitors more visitors from USA UK Canada and other countries top countries automatically your CPC will be higher as you can see in this example I have showed you recently so this is related to uh, topic if topic is something like business uh, technology or uh, something like uh, Forex or domain and web hosting insurance this kind of high topic which I already told you in a lecture so your CPC will be automatically higher and if you receive visitors from top countries then that will be double and the RPM as actually total revenue from thousand impressions so that is a s uh, not that necessary like CPC and CTR so I hope you will work or these areas if you can't work or you need more tips then you can post your question in the discussion uh, of this course so I will give you more specific I mean suggestions and tips according to your site and your own circumstances so this was about increasing CTR and CPC I hope you will in increase after my suggestions in this video now the next thing is to 
talk about AdSense scorecard. So see you soon in next lecture.